hello. Now, excuse us, we're a bit parched because yes. somebody has drank all his drink. <laughs> Three pints of Stella. Honestly, we get here and he wants to eat his lunch within half an hour of being here. And he's drank all his beer because, what did you say? It's better when it's cold. It's better when it's cold. Well, which it is. But he's also, <laughs> we've also drank my drink as well. So it is Wednesday, the 7th of September. It's a stunning day down here on Clan Maddock Beach. But we're going to have to go. It's about half past two now. Must be. Because we have no drink left and our lips are sticking to our mouths. Yes. So anyway, how are you? We are fine. It's great to be back vlogging with you. Um, we're now going to be doing one every week, so you can join us all through winter. Um, we'll be vlogging from Tenerife. Uh, as you know, we're going there for three months, so we'll be vlogging the journey. What it's like to travel now with all the Covid rules and the PCR. Is it PCR tests? I think so. Um, so We've we'll been be double vaccinated, so we should be all right. Well, you can never tell, can you? No. So we'll be vlogging our hotel, what we get up to, the restaurants, everybody that we're meeting. We're meeting a few people out there, some subscribers. So if you perhaps are going to be out there in Tenerife, we're staying in Los Cristianos, give us a bell. Drop us an email on gypsysoulstour at hotmail.com. <laughs> He got it right, because I didn't. That was about the fourth take. Yes. So, um, what have we been doing? We've had a very busy season. Everybody's gone now, virtually. We've just got a few stragglers uh, on the campsite. Um, the children have gone. Yeah, it's all... Uh... I was waiting for you to go, woohoo! Yeah. Um, so, it's a lot quieter. So, we've escaped to the beach today. Um, lovely what... day today. Beautiful. Absolutely stunning. Really lovely. So... What are we going to be doing? Well, we've got three weeks left before we leave. Um, got to say goodbye to the family. Very, very sad, but exciting because we're doing another chapter to our story, which we're sharing with you. So, um, what we're going to be doing then is going home back to the cottage where we for a will little be while, yeah. doing some restoration. Of course, we'll be vlogging that for you so you can see how we're getting on. Uh, and then we will be going down to Bristol so to say goodbye to the family. And then we shall be heading off to sunnier climates um, and taking you with us. We are. Aren't we? We are. So what are we going to do now? Well, right now, we're going to go and get a drink from Come Ivy Cafe. Um, and I think Mark wants to go to the pub, do you? Or should I, we? I should, think we should, yeah. Do you not want to go? Yeah, I do want to go. Oh, yeah. Do I even need to ask? So we're going to the Britannia Inn, which is a beautiful pub. Um, uh, that is not far away, but it's a 20 minute uh, walk to the car, which I'm not looking forward to because I'm really thirsty. Um, I won't be able to talk in a minute. Oh dear, what a shame. Well, you rejoin us once again. We're back on site now. Yeah, we decided not to go to the, to the Britannia Inn. We decided to go and get some alcoholic beverage from the local garage in Neilston. Yes, we have. Yes, and even I've had some. Two oh. spiced rum and cokes and now I'm on some wine with orange juice. Maybe he won't get so much hassle if I'm a bit tipsy as well. So here you have the Tipsy Gypsies. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, welcome back. Uh, as you can see, it's now absolutely baking still. When we got in the car, it was registering 31 degrees. 31 degrees in the car, it's um, We're back now at Kenningstone. Uh, we're going to just chill out and mong and... Yeah, what else are we going to do? Try and find some out for tea? Yeah, oh yeah, tea, food. Oh, God dear, that's after we've drank two bottles of wine and about eight cans of beer. Yes. I was joking. No, <laughs> I'm not. Anyway, what we forgot to mention um, to you is another um, announcement that we have to make. And that is, as you know, we get a lot of uh, wannabe wardens contacting us with advice about how to, you know, how to start doing this. And we got chatting to a couple and just instantly clicked with them, didn't we, really? We did, yeah. And we've managed to introduce them to uh, David, our owner, and he has taken them on for next year. Um, yes. So congratulations to them. They know who they are. Unfortunately, we can't disclose it just yet. Um, but once we've gi they've given us that, yes, you can, because we've told work, go ahead. We will introduce you to them and hopefully they'll become regulars on our vlogs. They will. Um, so that's really exciting. As you know, Kenningston is um, 
increasing. We are building a new build which Mark's helping out on now for the final three weeks. Um, it's incorporating a cafe, an ice cream parlour hopefully, um, a new reception and a lovely swanky shop. Shop, yeah. So um, obviously we're going to need more staff for that which we have now. Um, so it's going to be really exciting, isn't Next it? Next year is going to be really good. We're really looking forward to we it. We are, yes. And if you, have, if you haven't already gathered, we're coming back. Yes. We're coming back again and again and again. Yes, this is our forever site now, we believe. Yeah, and it's... For, for as long as they can put up with us. Well, there we are. I don't know. Might have to put earplugs in sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. You're talking anyway, oh, yeah. Oh, shut up. Anyway, um... Well, what else have we got to tell you? Well, let me just show you what we've done because obviously it does get a little bit windy here in the Gower and as you know, our awning's taken a bit of a battering. So what we've done, we didn't know we were going to get this heat wave, is we've taken it down already. Now let me show you what we've done. We're starting to dismantle everything. So here we are. Oh, there's me washing. Nick is on the line. We don't want to see them. So... And here we are, you can see the campsite is emptying out now. And we have our view back. This time last week it was absolutely heaving. It was so, rammed. Here we go. Look at that poor old grass. Luckily the sheep will sort that out over the winter for us. So what have you got to say then, Mark? All I can say is more beer. Oh, for goodness sake. You know what? Anybody would think that all we do is drink. Well, obviously him. And you'll be right. No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. We just make a joke out of it. He's not actually supposed to be drinking at all, according to the doctor. But hey ho, such is life, isn't such it? Such is life. Um, can we also just say a massive thank you to everybody, all our subscribers that have come to visit us um, through the summer? There's been absolutely loads of you, and and sadly we can't spend a lot of time with you when you come in the busy periods because uh, we work all through the day and night all different hours we really appreciate you coming um, and we hope we spent enough time with you a big shout out to calvin and anne yes calvin and anne from porth core so sad we couldn't see see much of you would have loved to have had a beer with you in the evening but it just wasn't to be because we obviously had to man the fort um there is also terry from burnley oh yeah from Burnley, the beers that I tripped over coming out of the awning but thank you very much Mark was delighted he had a smile on his face all day uh, there was also Margaret and Alan Simpson it was brilliant to meet I hope you're gonna come back you comment a lot on our vlogs uh, we'd really love to see you as we would love to see you all but come next year now because we're going to have a fantastic site with our swanky new shop, as I tell everybody. It's, she's promising so much. Well, we, we that's it. <laughs> it's got to be done. We shall be in regular contact with the owner, David and Anthony, to make sure they're not slacking. <laughs> <laughs> a shout out to Colin too. We love you to bits, don't we? Yes, Colin, yes. And if you've, uh, Colin if, and his tractor. If you've been to Kenningston, you will know Colin. You'll also know our lawn mower man, Costa. Aka Richard, who uh, keeps um, our lawns here in Kenningston looking like Wembley, does a fantastic job. Thank you so much for your massive support. Uh, we are back, we are coming at you bigger and better, um, and we hope you'll stay with us and join us for our antics around Tenerife. Please, if you've got any ideas that you want us to vlog on, um, we're going to start doing some more caravan vlogs because things are starting to go wrong in our caravan because obviously she is getting a bit old, but we're not buying another, are we? No. We're going to try and sort that out. We'll be showing you all those repairs as well. So on that note, we're off to drink more and we will see you again next week. We will. Bye. Bye.